what is going on guys, Burning Spirit Fire back with some more Pokemon Black 2. So last time we got here in this desert area we caught Amanda Buzz. And uh, this time we're going to be continuing on and trying to get to the next city uh, where the fourth gym is. So that's pretty cool, that's what we're doing. And I think this is the way we're going to go. I think. But I don't know if these people have asked me. Let's talk to them and find out. Uh, no, but they mentioned the Relic Castle or something? Let me check what castle they're talking about. Uh, the Relic Castle, yeah. Don't know if that is of giant importance in this game, but it's something. Um, yeah, I don't know if that's right, but we'll come over here and check out what's going down. Alright, we'll take on this trainer, because who doesn't want to battle this person, I guess. Alright, so we're taking down Nurse Maria, or something like that. Nurse Marion is what she should be called. Uh, Kunan, definitely my best Pokemon. Uh, I'm gonna go for this reversal, it is super effective. Probably won't kill it though, because I'm going first. Reversal does more damage when it goes second. Yeah. Miracle Leaf, interesting. Yeah, Clefairy and that, they can learn a lot of different moves. I mean, that is why they're so good to add to your team, because the amount of moves they can learn is really good. I mean, they can learn so many cool moves, so, you know, if you, if you want one, I'd recommend adding it to your team, because they definitely come in handy. And Zeus gets level 19, which is awesome. And yeah, she'll now heal you, so you can just talk to her whenever you want, and she'll heal you again, which is nice. Really helps out, so you can do that training. Um, alright, we'll throw Eno up front because Eno is close to evolution and I would like to, to evolve in this episode. Well, that's you because you look like you're in or you are wearing karate stuff and you don't even battle me. God damn it. I was hoping you are going to battle me because you wore karate stuff and that made sense. Uh, I don't even need to do that, but I guess we'll use it. And I'll spray another repel off us, Mr. Ranger Guy. I will show you the hardness of the desert to a battle. I don't know, I can sort of already tell that the desert's pretty hard because this, you know, sandstorm sort of hurts. I mean, who just sits in a sandstorm? It's not very good. I mean, I would not just stand around here all day in a sandstorm. It would not be very good. Definitely for your eyes. It's going to get in your eyes, all that sand. This is going to be annoying for everyone. I mean, it just doesn't seem like a nice day at all. It seems like a very, very poor and, you know, it's a very gay day. And that fire one, that one fire punch kills me. I mean, this freaking this Pokemon is very strong. And who am I gonna send in? I guess we'll. I don't know. We'll send in uh, Zeus, I guess. But yeah, Harumaka, good Pokemon, very strong. Another fire punch, probably do a lot of damage. Wow, what the hell? It's killing me in one hit. I did not think its attack was that high. Honestly, I did not. But then again, 500 is a strong move. But still, it doesn't make too much sense. That is weird. That, that is very weird. Uh, well. I guess we'll lower your attack now. See, you like it, you son of a bitch. We'll go for Fire Fang. And it doesn't do too much. And you're paralyzed. You know, you know take that. And we both hurt by the desert. All good. Go for another Fire Fang. Why not? nearly kills it. That facade. See, this thing knows some good attacks. That nearly killed me in general. Such a... Man, tough stuff. Really tough. But we take it down. And, yeah, Conan gets some good experience. Was that Jaden? Or Jaden? I didn't see a J. But either way, you're gonna give me a raspberry, which is nice. Well, sort of. I mean, you don't get burned very often. It's more like paralyzed and poisoned, but, you know, either way, free berry, it's free berry. You're gonna want it, but luckily, uh, we got this person to heal me up right there. And there's an item around it somewhere. There we go, we get a star piece. Don't know if they do anything in this game, in Platinum they heal up. Oh, actually, in Platinum you can use them to make money. Well, I, you know, my mind is went... Fully, sorry, my mind just went blank. 
Uh, you, you can sell Star Wings to make money, but in Platinum you can sell them to get sh like one shard each. Which, uh, like in this, like in Platinum and in this game, you can sell shards for like moves and stuff. But um, I don't think they have the whole star piece for shards in this game, which sucks because it would really come in handy because you get a lot of star pieces in this game. But either way, it doesn't really matter too much. And you can avoid my air cutter. That is just rude. Okay. Did you avoid it yet? Did you avoid my air cutter again? Yes, you did. You're really pissing me off. I don't like missing. It's one thing I do not like. I mean, I'm getting really annoyed. I feel like I'm just going to stop paddling now because I hate it when I keep missing. It gets really annoying. Like that one rat in Platinum with Defog, and it's like if you don't have Defog on you, you like miss every goddamn attack, and it's just so frustrating. I mean, it's just terrible. But this will kill it, hopefully. Yeah, it does. Which is nice. Okay, so we got an item around here somewhere. There we go, a blue shard. Nice. Alright, another item up here. We get a red shard. So we can find some good shards here. Also take the Mr. Person with the backpack on. Because we need that experience, especially coming up to the next gym. But we did get uh, the TM for Deeg last turn, or last episode. So that's definitely going to come in handy. Don't know who can learn it. I know Eevee can learn it. But Eevee's going to need some experience if that's the case. And a sand dial. And intimidate. You're going to lower my attack, are you? That is rude. I'm going to send in spirit. Embargo is gonna stop me from using Autumn, I think. Yeah, interesting. Very interesting move. Don't really know why it's worth it here. It's more good in like gym battles, I guess. But uh, yeah, random trainers and stuff probably isn't very important. And we take down that dude. That was very easy. Okay. Um, yep, yeah, staying on that item, we have a ground gem there. Interesting. I'm not going to do Relic Castle, I may do it in future episodes, but right now we're just going to take on this trainer. And I'm seeing an item up there, so I'll get that after this battle. Psychic powers right there, making that ball float up and down. And I'm going to send in Eno. Check out how much uh, Gus does. Hopefully it does at least half, that way you know it can at least kill something. But then again, that insurance did a lot of damage. Yeah, that sucks. Alright, we'll switch into... Fluffy or Zeus, whatever. In prison. That steals... Um, Okay, interesting. I don't really, okay, I don't really get that, but all right, we'll go for a thunder shock. Heart stamp. It's like a signature move. Pretty cool. Oh, I didn't even kill it. Uh, Woobat's a pretty decent Pokemon. I've used one once. Very good, actually. I probably do prefer it over P Dove. It's just that I have a thing for when I do walkthroughs. I always uh have to use like the normal flying dart. It's just a thing. And I'm hitting the mark right there. Sorry about that. Um, I'm also tapping the mic right now, because I had to put it into place. So again, I apologize, but we get to level 20, and we're learning takedown. I'll probably just get rid of tackle, because that makes sense. You know, takedown is probably just like an upgrade of tackle. But then again, you do get re recoil damage, but either way, it's all good. And you got one more Pokemon, uh, Yamask, which I think is like Ghost or something. Um, I don't know. I'm sending Conan, why not? Conan does a good job. But uh, I never used a, 
a Yamask, but they are pretty good from what I could tell. I mean, great defense, great, uh, there's good everything, like, good attack, good defense, good special defense. Actually, no, not good special defense, I'm thinking of another Pokemon. Yeah, it's just basically the physical stats is what it's good at. So, pretty decent Pokemon. I don't know what level it evolves, so it could be, you know, hard to, like, raise, but it does have the ability Mummy, which means anything that does physical contact, its ability will change. That comes in handy. It's pretty cool. I'm gonna go for an Ember because, uh, you know, uh, special attacks do a lot more damage. And Nightshade is gonna kill me, that's exactly its level, which is 22, so. Yeah, Kunan's dead, but whatever. Um, I think I'm faster, so I should be able to send in Eno and use a Gust. I think I'm faster, I should be. Yeah, cool. Didn't even kill it, but you missed, so lucky me. That was very lucky, very, very lucky, but then Willow Wisp wouldn't really have done too much anyway, so. Whatever, either way. Um, I don't know why I did that. I gotta hit that Dowsy machine again, check out this item. Okay, it's up. No. Oh, there we go, Super Repel comes in handy. Uh, item over here, let's pick that up. It is a heart scale. Interesting. Good item. So that's cool, I think I've explored enough here. I'm gonna um, go to where I need to go to get to the next city. Because that is my destination in this episode. And there's a yellow shard, so always good picking up these shards. I'll probably come back here at some point. Maybe show it off. That's a maybe. But um, at the moment, just uh, trying to get a move on. Trying to get this, uh, you know, get through this game quick. Because, you know, desert area should pretty much just be me battling and stuff. And that's not too exciting. I mean, I guess I could edit them out, but nah. That's a lot of effort. But, uh, yeah. I have no repels left. But that's okay, because I think I don't need too many anymore. I'll get on my bike here. Oh, I'm on a bicycle. You did not see that coming. Um, no, it doesn't matter. So we're gonna come up uh, as a battle. Okie dokie. Let's take this guy with a hat on. Hey, you, stop right there. He's got two Pokemon. And he's got that cane thing. It's gonna smack people around the head with it. He's like, cha cha cha. This guy's gonna start with a Rylu. Good matchup right now. I got a uh, Eno or Eno Force Palm. Fair bit of damage, and this Gust is probably isn't gonna kill it on one hit. No, it doesn't. It sucks. Force Palm do like exactly half. So I'm gonna send in. Oh man! All right, I'll just send in Spirit. The Spirit's only level 18, which sort of sucks, but yeah. And I think the next gym's like level 27. I could be in trouble. I guess we'll see what happens. Ah, oh, go for a leaf tornado. Yeah, good damage, good damage indeed. All right, a growl. I'm gonna send an Eno again because I really want Eno, Eno, Eno. I really want Eno to evolve because it would just help out a lot. Should be able to take more hits and stuff. It'd just be overall, just be a fantastic thing. It's fantastic. It's fantastic. Alright, we'll send in um, Zeus. See if she can, or he can do something good. Yeah, we're gonna paralyze with that static. Take that, Ralph. We're gonna go for that uh, shockwave. Hopefully, it does a good amount of damage. Uh, critical hit? Yeah, I'm good with that. I'm okay with that critical hit. Now this Thundershock should kill it. And away we go. I think Eno is now going to evolve. I think. I was told level 21, so I guess we'll see what happens. Yes, she is. It is about time. So let's sit back and watch Eno's evolution. There we go. 
Eno is now a Tranquil, which is a very good Pokemon. Very, uh, you know, stats-wise, it's going to really increase altogether, and it's just going to be great for everyone. Mostly me, because I'm using one. But, with that said, we are like, um... I'm trying to get off my bike. Damn it. There we go. But yeah, we are like in this area, which is like... I don't... I missed it, but... It's a weird... I don't even get this. I guess I've never really played this part in English before. Um... Yeah, I guess, I don't know, I guess I add this place just to make it the game fancier or something. I don't really get it. Um, but we'll manage to, yeah, sure. I think I need to answer a few things. I don't think I can avoid this. Um, uh, what is your favorite phase? Um, we're just gonna, we're just gonna write Pi. Because Pi, I believe, is a good phase. It's a great line. It is a great line. It really is. I'm glad you agree. Um, what do you say when... What do you say when impressed? Uh, what do I say when impressed? I feel, like I, I feel like I say indeed. Even though I clearly don't. But uh, indeed sounds good. Pie indeed. Yeah, that, that makes sense. That sounds like something I would say actually. Pie indeed. Pie indeed. Okay, they're just gonna leave now. Interesting. Oh wow, what is your title? Um, we'll just go with something cool. I mean, that's not really cool. But, it's, you know, it's basic. And it is a uh, king. That is right. I am a king. Bow down to me. Down to your king. Alright, so we're running, 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 running. This place looks fancy. Waterfall right there, bitchin'. It's the tits. But, uh, yeah, anyway. We got, uh, this joint avenue. Alright, cool. Here we are in Nimbasa City. Don't know why I couldn't remember Nimbasa City. It's such a basic thing. I don't know why I came over here for. Alright, gonna jump on this bicycle. It's gonna quickly show you show off an item that's important, which is right here. Actually, no, there's a hidden item. Sorry, which is right there. It's a thunderstone. Get to pick up that thunderstone. Could evolve an Eevee into a Jolteon if you want it. Either way, we're gonna heal up, and next time we're gonna go do some stuff in Nimbasa City, explore the place, all that good stuff. So, remember to like, subscribe, all that good. Oh, I've said that so many times, but you know, whatever. See you later.